Iderent is an equipment banker. We cannot influence the market. We can only deliver large quantities to other production companies. So when the market is needed, large quantities, the brand that we invest in, there a lot of production companies can do a job with larger quantities. Our group will not invest in equipment before it's on the riders. So with the GBL uh, V25, we ordered it before it was out on the market. Um, this with the reason that we have a close communication line with Paul Bowman in the design of the cabinet. So the speakers, the 15 inch can handle 2 kilowatt uh, continued power. The 8 inch can uh, have also a very high efficiency and have also a high power rating. There are six membranes in each com uh, cabinet. This means you have much less distortions in the high frequency because you put much less power on each membrane. All those parametrics together has, this, has changed our investment policy by investing before it's on the riders and helping other production companies by, if they invest in a system, that we can give them an access to large quantities. In the future, maybe you will see this happens uh, with other products also, but it's been done also in the past. For example, ProLite Trussing, we were the first investor in ProLite Trussing. Today, there's about 70 kilometers, 8,000 corner blocks, 300 circles who are in our stock out there to help other rental companies with their creativity in lighting. So it's not alone in sound but also in lighting equipment. We saw this with Clay Parky. We invested massively in Clay Parky before it was out there on every rider. Same with LED products. Maybe you know or everybody knows that the Copenhagen top three, four years ago was done with thousand moving heads with LED lighting. Those were German light products. Also here we were long before the market is asking the product with the product on the market. Our group got a technical boardroom, it's called the G8. Two sound guys, two lighting guys, two video guys, the head of TD and head of the warehouse. They have a technical view of 360 degree, not alone a view like a sound engineer or not alone a view like a lighting engineer, but a 360 degree view of handling, of uh, repair it. Uh, those techni this technical committee is deciding together with me uh, which kind of products we will invest. Also, all of our people got a quite good here in the market, so we listen what the mar market needs. The market is for us the 6,800 rental houses in Europe. I didn't get in their equipment park about 5,000 different products. In the 26 years that I'm running the business, uh, we had done about eight bad decisions, but eight on 5,000 products, I think it's more than acceptable. What our clients are doing with equipment, it's not our thing. Um, the only what our thing is, when it's coming back, every moving head, every speaker, every motor, even every cable will be tested and cleaned and placing back in mint condition in the warehouse. If something is broken, we will repair it and some articles will be invoiced to the clients. If the clients are using a cabinet on a bad way, a speaker cabinet, and the corner is ripped off for a half inch or a centimeter, the corner is teared off, we will invoice a new corner, not a cabinet. We have a repair shop uh, where three people are working full-time on wood repair and repainting. 
this is what we do. Done two orders of the GBL. The first order 216 V25s and second order 72 uh, V25s. All will come in before the 1st of June. They will be operational for the summer. Uh, yes, it's a large quantity compared to a production company, but we have 1200 clients in Europe are coming average 30 times, 40 times per year picking up equipment. So you need to cut this quantity maybe to divide it to 50 uh, companies, uh, so it's a small number. Today we have in line array models more than 1500 line array models in our rental fleet, so 300 cabinets from GBL, it's only 20% more. Thank you.